Today we are taking a child's game and making it into a very much grown adult game because, well, adults need games too. So, for a kid's party, you might play Pin the Tail on the Donkey. Boom! This one right here. Uh, this one's a cheap one. I mean, these are the tails. You cut them out. They're all paper. It was $3 on Amazon, so I don't know what I was expecting. The Sweet Sweet Blindfold is also super cheap. That's what you get for $3 on Amazon. I don't even know if this will fit my big ass head. Yeah, okay. For those of you who don't know Pin the Tail on the Donkey, I don't know where you've been. You cut out all these little tags, blindfold on, they spin around, and you point them at it, and they have to try and pin, well, the tail on the, on the donkey. It's pretty much self-explanatory. We're gonna make the adult version. I bought a few more things. I bought party hats, uh, sticky tack, and confetti cannons that shoot confetti. That would make a really fun kids party. The kids get to wear a hat, they get to play pin the tail on the donkey, we get to shoot confetti cannons, but we grown ass people. It's not gonna be that fun. We're gonna combine all these things to one adult only game that's gonna be kind of dangerous, but super fun. All right, move aside, donkey. We'll get to you later. And we're gonna need some tiny little nails. You can get these at the dollar store. Yeah, anything like that. Get something that's like an inch. It really doesn't matter. It's not like a big, not like a big roofing nail. That's all that matters. You're gonna need the sticky tack and this and this. That's step one. Okay, so you rip this open. We don't need the top of this confetti can anymore. We're gonna say piss it to the confetti. We're not gonna use the confetti. No confetti. We're gonna dump this confetti out. Where we're going, we don't need confetti. This is gonna be more fun than confetti. So when you twist them, they have a blast. They go like it's boom, baby, boom. I don't, I don't know what to call it, but it's very exciting. I've messed with these before. It's one shot, but it's one hell of a shot. So we're gonna build that, and that is how we're gonna fire the tail for this pin the tail on the donkey. So we need something uh, that's gonna be able to shoot the tail out. If you just put one of those donkey tails in there, it would just fire out like one piece of confetti. It'd be like, Meh. You need something that's gonna have a little bit of aim to it, and it's gonna push it out. So I give to you the birthday party hat. Instead of wasting a hat on a child's head, take it, and you're gonna cut it so it fits. Right there, whatever that distance is, that's where you want to cut it. So what I always do is I reinforce it first with some tape. I tape up the seam. Yeah, it's just, oh, there we go. This is definitely not an exact science. Well, it probably is, but I don't do it that way. That's like, that's a really, that's a really nice fit. Sticky tack. We're gonna break off a big chunk like this. We stick the nail in it. It's gonna go right in here. See how it comes through like that? You just push a little bit. It's gonna rip. Why don't we start with number one? Oh no. Now, I think if I just stick this in here, that'll be the tail. You shoot it, and your tail will be there, I guess. This is the plan. Hey, might work. Is this one of the weirdest things I've ever made? I don't know, maybe. This goes in here, like that. I like that you can see through these. A lot of these confetti cannons you can't see through. I like that we can actually show the inside here. I might clean out this confetti, but it's kind of cool that it pops up with it, I don't know. So that's the plan. Six empty confetti cannons and six donkey dart tails, or whatever you wanna call them. We're pretty much ready. All right, where's our donkey? This is a flimsy paper trash. Piece of, uh, piece of whiteboard here. I have a lot of tape on this. This is what I used for my magic trick I did on Ellen. Oh, just dropped a sick name there. Sorry about that. <laughs> Let me just put that back up there. No, I, I did a magic trick on Ellen and I, I had a bunch of uh, cards, a whole deck of cards taped on here and I was throwing knives at it. Hey, reduce, reuse, recycle. So there'll be a little piece of tape on it. I'm not gonna bother picking them off. We'll just deal with it. They might even help us, who knows? Yeah. Well, she ain't pretty, but looks aren't everything. I feel like if you get it anywhere in here, this is the spot. Maybe we'll make like a winner's circle like. The last step here is the blindfold. When you got a big head like an adult, these strings, not for it. So I say we put it on, put it on some glasses. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go shoot this thing. Five. Five paces, 15 feet. Should we try from here? All right, let's try from here. Number one. Here, put the focus on the board. On the donkey's ass. Oh man, should 
shot. Thought. <laughs> okay. First, first shot. First shot. Not gonna be blind. Not gonna be blind. Well, that went flying out. Did not stick in the board. The tail blasted right off. Wow, it all came apart. Where did that hit? Not there, that's for sure. <sighs> okay, test two. No, I got it. <laughs> Not brave enough for those yet. Oh! <gasps> Yo, that one stuck awesome. Holy crap, it really blew apart. Let's use a lot more tape. I'm gonna really tape the shit out of the next one. This is good. Number three, you are stronger than ever. Let's do number three. Glasses this time? Let's do it with the glasses. Lock and load. I was turning the wrong way. <laughs> Too scared. Here we go. <laughs> a little bit low. Stuck in the plywood though, so in reference for the power. Still very far from my donkey ass though. I'm done with the blindfold for today. Test four. Oh no. Some of these are duds, you gotta watch out. Here we go. The new test four. Where'd that one go? I was so excited for the slow-mo that I forgot to reinforce my last dart. You gotta reinforce it. Lots of tape on these donkey dart things. Donkey, donkey tail darts. Number five. Number six. Never wanna be looking down there when these things are loaded. This is how you play pin the tail on the donkey when you're a grown ass man. Let's go. <laughs> Woo! Oh, yes! Come with me, look at that. What a shot to finish on. What a shot to finish on. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's great, isn't that great? I mean, that's a dead donkey. That is a dead donkey. Doesn't get any better than that. This works? Well, shit, that was exciting. I'm, I'm damn proud of that. What's the point of being an adult if you can't build dumb shit? And this really does work. This works great. You definitely don't need the blindfold. The confetti cannon dart launcher is random enough that it evens out the playing field. If you were standing around with six friends, each taking a shot, um, it is quite sporadic. So you don't even need to blindfold yourself. I, I really thought it was a hell of a good time. Super big victory at the end there, hitting it like, almost right on the ass. Um, well, hitting the ass on the ass. I think that's how they do it, I don't know. I only had eight confetti cannons, and they're about six to eight bucks a piece, depending on where you buy them. So it does get kind of expensive, so that's why I only bought eight. Eight confetti cannons, one turned out to be a dud. That happens sometimes. So I really only had seven shots. Seven shots, six darts. I was only playing by myself, but that was still a pretty good game. Thanks for joining me. See you in the next one. Bye.